Welcome to the Middle Room Workshop. Today, let's do something offline with our Long Array 5. As usual, the project that we are going to build will be free to download on my website. Today, we are going to build a key organizer for the wall. So without wasting any more time, let's get into it. All right, so let's insert our SD card on our PC and let's drop the two files that I've prepared on the SD card. Once we are done with that, let's get the SD card and let's get to our machine. There we go. Now let's get into engrave and let's select our file. That's part one to start. All right, first thing first, we are going to load the material. Okay, we are also going to drop a nice magnet here. So it's going to keep everything steady. Actually, let's rotate the sheet. Yeah, that feels a bit better now. And let's move the machine to the corner. If you haven't done that, don't forget to arrange the laser height with a block that comes with a machine. And now let's see how we are going to do that. Let's first confirm the position and frame. Okay, I would repeat that once again before to start. So let's click on back and frame that again. All right, I think we can move just to optimize the material by a couple of millimeters. Let's register the position and frame again. All right. So once we are ready, now the file contains already all the power parameters. So we can simply click on go. And we can also turn on our fan. Now we can leave the machine to work. All right, it is now time for part two. Let's move the laser head by hand once again. And let's confirm the position. Let's frame. Let's go back and let's frame once again. 
All right, so we can confirm. All right, so once you cut out both files these are all the parts that you should end up with uh, so you should have six hooks and then all the other parts all right so the easiest way to assemble this is to first prepare uh, all of the components that goes attached to the shelf and then everything goes together uh, onto the back plate okay so i'll just turn this upside down and I will, I will start inserting the hooks to start. So everything is designed with interference fit. So you will find it a little bit hard, but it will make sure that everything snap together without any need of glue. All right, so this is supposed to be the final result for the hooks. And now let's stick on top the small box. So let me first put this together. Okay. Now you should put this here. Now, if you have some uh, uh, wood, you can put it under. Now, if you see that it's so hard, uh, you can try and hit it a little bit. So you can use a hammer or something just to pry it in. As you can see, it got inside. Right now, I'm going to put the last piece here in front. And we can continue with the hammer, which makes it a little bit easier. All right. So this is what you should get. Now the final part is to put everything together. Now this will be a little bit uh, difficult because you have to align all of those parts together. But if you start from one side and easy, easy stick them in, you will see that it's nothing difficult.
All right, so this is pretty much all for this project. I hope you liked it. It is um, a useful device. If you want to apply this to the wall, just use a little bit of uh, double-sided tape on the back plate, and that will be pretty much good. Um, as usual, all the files will be free for download on my website. You will find the link in the video description below. You will also find the link to where you can buy uh, the longer Ray 5 machine or longer Ray 5 with the 10 watt, which is the latest model. And for the time being, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you have any comments, leave them in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this one. Ciao for now.